Or, or yeah, you had to loot a chest and it was just gone. I don't know. Like, well, I guess or that's... destroy an obstacle and there wasn't any obstacles. New blood. You wipe the blood off the last verminine from your face, and your thoughts return to the sleeping lion. Surely they've got a stew ready by now. It'd be so perfectly warm and soothing, and it's right through the gate. So close, you can already taste it. But then, another that comes. It's highly unusual. Brazen, really, for a pack of vermlings to operate this close to the city. Could they be behind this string of disappearances? It's a long shot, but one worth investigating. Especially considering this ambush site doesn't look like their base of operations. There's probably a nest nearby that, with any luck, we'll have more information on the missing blacksmith. And treasure. Treasure would be nice. And it's all right, and the treasure's gone. We got six experience, and we're going strong. A hole in the wall. Okay, city quest. Um, why don't we have a city encounter? We only can encounter one city encounter per visit to Gloomhaven. Oh, since we didn't leave Gloomhaven. All right. Well, we could continue doing this one. I think that's what we should do. Even though we're not leaving Gloomhaven. We're almost level 2 already. Already halfway there. I'm I'm down. You got way more money than I did that time. You had zero. You, got, you didn't loot a single thing. I was busy. <laughs> that's what I was saying. I was like, well, that's why I just started looting things. I was like, well, I'm already not going to get my thing. <laughs> You're walking through the coin district when a woman in green with thick goggles springs from a nearby window and bowls you over. Coins and expensive trinkets scatter as they spill from the robber's pockets. She brushes herself off and notices two guards peering down the alley, their attention drawn by the commotion. Ha ha ha! That was a good one! She laughs dramatically and claps you on the back, making a show of it for the guards. She winces as someone shrieks, Thief! from the window. The guards break into a run towards you, and the woman mutters, Follow my lead, and we'll get out of this. Otherwise, we're all getting sent to the ghost fortress. Got it? Turn her over to the guards, or let the thief work her charms. Let's see what she can do. Let's see what she can do. Boom. They went that way! The green-clad woman swoons against the building as the guard approaches, pointing farther off down the alley. Please, you have to do something. I think they killed someone. The guards look at each other and charge into the shadows. See? That wasn't so hard, was it? Very really quips she bends down, grab the fallen valuable. Here, for your trouble. Now you'd better clear out before they return. Ten gold each. Alright, well ten collective, so five each. Alright. You can't shake the uneasy feeling that those vermlings were too close to the city walls and decide to revisit the scene of their ambush. Perhaps you'll find signs of the blacksmith there, too. Tracks are easy to spot. Vermlings have never been known for their subtlety. You follow the scratching and indicators of a body being dragged until you find yourself approaching the walls of Gloomhaven. The sun's very low, but something isn't right. That isn't just a shadow cast across the lower section of the wall. It's a hole! The Vermlings have made a nest for themselves by burrowing into the wall itself. How industrious. Alright. That one or that one? Hmm. I mean, I feel like this one will be the easier of the two. Though I like the other one. Do I want to change up my cards at all? Uh, no, I think I think this is fine. We got snakes this time, though. I don't like snakes. They are not nice. Use R to rotate your area of effect. You crouch low and try to sneak closer, but they must have guards watching the entrance. There's a shrill shrieking, and then. 
A number of verlings jump from the dark, brandishing their dull, poorly made weapons. No choice now but to defend yourself. I think I can stand here. And. Hmm. Let's do that. Don't believe that I'm moving super fast. Not at all. Though the raiders are disarming. Oh, my goodness. Classic. Your attacks in well. Yeah. Alright, well. Let's move here. Kaboom. I could avoid getting hit by a disarm by that guy if I didn't want to strengthen myself, but I want to strengthen myself. Smack you in the face. Kaboom. That's the one punch. And the two punch. Boom. Yeah, get out of here, you meerkat. See, it's just that easy. You just punch him, and then you punch him again. Okay, where is the other... Okay, the other door is right behind this raider up top. I had to get my wits about me. So room is up there. Just these, all the seven health ones are the ones that are doing the disarming. To the trap that was behind this I pushed the other guy through it and killed him. Oh. Uh, sorry. Language. Whatever. Uh, huh, huh. Let's go here. Push him. You get closer to the trap and you can push him through a trap next time. We'll attack the... Does that mean that you're trying to trigger a trap? Like I was last time. Who knows? I just like doing extra damage. Me too. Okay, well I'm getting disarmed. You're getting disarmed. Oh, maybe you're not getting disarmed. I'll take. Depend. He's probably attacking me. So. Double disarmed. I my arms are both gone. Okay. Well. It can still do some damage, which is nice. All right, this is this is fine. It's not what I want to do, but but when you have no arms, you got to do what you you can with. What you got? Oh, does he not count as next to a wall? That might be... This might be bad. I don't think he's next to a wall. I may have messed up. Yeah, he's technically not next to a wall. There's a little gap. Oh, no, he is. Perfect. Okay. So that doesn't count as an attack, so that's why I can do it while disarmed. And then I'm gonna... are they... It's poisoning. Well, I'm gonna heal before I get poisoned. Since I don't have a way to get rid of it. Later. Nice, nice. Oh, attack the little sc uh, uh, yeah. I guess. Attack the uh, this guy. Or this guy. um. So the scout is the only one that's he's not moving. Um, I think you should hit the one health guy and finish him off. Right. Nice, Ooh. barely. I'll heal you the zero that you can heal. Oh. Well, if I knew you were healing, I wouldn't use my potion. Yeah, I didn't really, I didn't really ask. 
or look at what you had going on. I could have looked before I did anything. You had your card selected. Okay. One, two, three, four. So I could finish that guy off. I think I'm just going to finish off the guy in front of me. Do it. I believe. I believe. I believe. Do you believe in God? I believe. I believe in God. Right. And the Raiders are doing some stuff. Alright, get out of my face. Kapow! Um, and these are all just piles of two. I don't really want to open the door. I don't want to. I don't want to know what's going on back there yet. I'm just gonna move here and get some money. Of course you would. Oh, were you gonna do something? I was gonna kill him and loot, but I didn't kill him, so. Hey, now I'm getting attacked. Yay! Lucky. Isn't he love? Oh, that not wasn't that wasn't that was not lucky at all. Hmm. All right. Oh, he's gonna try and loot. I don't think so. Oh, nice. Come on. Heck yeah. Exaxies. I mean, burnt that card, but no, it's definitely worth it. Destroy that. Smack you. Oh, bro, you did six? Yeah, I had my plus thing going on. Yeah, I didn't either. But there was. Viper. One, two, three. Nope, he's not going to do any of those things. I am. I'm very stunning. Thank you for noticing. If I go here, this guy's only going to heal anyway, so it doesn't matter if I stun him. If I go here, I get gold. Mm-hmm. If I go here, I also get gold. I think it's better to just get right in the snake's face. What cards do I have left? I'm gonna have... Let's just go right here. Stun them all. I stunned them all. Short rest. I guess I'm getting rid of rubble. Both times. I really want to use the big one. I think the most important thing is to make sure I don't die.
right. See how this goes. So we will move here. Compile. Let's get movement. Destroy that. Oh, that was a big old obstacle. Did not know they were all connected, but that's cool. So we will smack these guys for advantage. That was pretty bad advantage, but it did get rid of the snake. So yeah, that's the one that I was worried about. These guys do a lot of damage for us, uh, having not that much health. All right, well, let's yeah, burn yeah. one available card. We're gonna wind up. I don't have the time to to be winding stuff up right now. This should be a decent turn. I think I'll be able to take out both of these guys. Well, I'll be able to take out one of them and not be dead. Though, uh, once you take care of that guy down there, it would be nice to get some healing. Start to decide what you want to do. Okay, all of them. Oh, some... oh, they're attacking before us. That's not good. Oh no! Oh no! Well, I don't want to run the heal one. Let's get rid of my fancy hat for now. Goodbye, hat. It's a sad day when I have to lose my hat. Well. I have a couple, yeah. Not a lot. Oh my goodness, both oh. of those just did one damage. So that's all you have. Curses. I'm gonna buy some better equipment. Okay, well, I'm gonna smack you in the face. Not quite enough. I'm gonna stun and poison this guy. Plus one? Nope. Damn. Close though. Very close. I'm surrounded by traps, I just realized. Yes, you are. You okay, I only have one more move. Okay, I theoretically can heal you. No, I mean, like, this is my last turn, no matter oh. if I'm healed or not. Alright. Well, maybe I don't heal you. Yeah, I would. Heal myself. Uh, okay, so they are attacking and disarming. Stunned. Yes. So I think the best thing would be to push this guy through a trap. And then leave the one health one for you to take out. Does that sound good? Works for me. Okay, so I'm going to move here. Skip movement. Destroy that. Make sure I don't get a a negative because I'm strong. Well, I mean, I got a negative. I mean, I meant like not get a. Uh, you didn't null though. I didn't null. All right, so he's stunned and poisoned, so he's good. I got some gold. I trust you can finish this off. I mean, if you can do that, that'd probably be the better. I don't have, I have range three, range three, and that was four away. Ah. Uh, but I will just attack him. Where was that plus one last turn? Let's see, let's see. Give myself one. 
And you get your favorite back. Heck yeah. That is ideal. Alright, well this guy's gonna finish me off, and I don't have a way... Leaving me on my own. I mean, I can do this. Oh, you're okay. That works too. And then I'll just die at the beginning of this turn. <laughs> I'm exhausted. So once you run out of cards, you become exhausted. And you don't get to take any part in the rest of the battle. But uh, you can still kind of see what's going on. So that guy's no longer stunned. Get some loot. I feel like there's only going to be a two or three guys in the last room. That's still a lot compared to just you. Uh, are they doing range attacks? Yes. Gross. Oh my oh, god. Oh, the worst. Should have should have made it my favorite. That really sucks. Now I'm wounded. Yep, you are not gonna make it out of here. Oh Unlucky. That is, that is very unfortunate. That one's rough. That one was rough. Alright, we'll see how this goes. Aw oh, man, I wanted to keep the cheaper. Okay. Well, let's uh let's try to kill somebody. Let's try to kill another person. You still have the thing that lets you move two extra spaces? I don't, I didn't use it yet. Because uh, you could attack the one health guy and then run up behind this guy and push him two into the trap. Yeah. Yeah, if you like care package that guy and then moved and pushed that guy into the trap. Good enough. I just had to get out of this guy's range. Oh. And I'm gonna, I'm gonna die. Just next turn. You should see if you can get to the, if you can get to the door, we can at least see what's through it, and then we'll know. Can you please heal yourself. Get out of here with that BS. Oh, you can't even reach the door. Then I guess money is the best way to do it. You can still reach him with your favorite. That's good. Use everything. No, oh, oh, that guy is sturdy. Sturdy. He's stung, so he's not going to heal. <laughs> That's good. Ugh. Okay, well, you still have enough life that you can reach the door. Short rest. Definitely not. Oh, you could have clicked on the... No, no, you're right. It was burning anyway. So you're right. Yeah. We lost already. We did. That was rough. Defeat. Well, um, yeah, I had the same exact thing. Let's go back to map. And uh, then let's try. Yeah, I kind of want to do the borrow, and uh, then we can go back to this one after. Sure. We'll do a little alternating storylines. Jaws. Yeah. I mean, I guess we can do two quests of the barrow because it's kind of connected. Okay, I'm exhausted 12 times. Okay, that's your long-term goal. I guess we get to see each other's long-term goals, which is nice. So you need to become exhausted 12 times. Nice. I have to kill 20 elite monsters from the base game. Which, I guess we weren't in the base game, so killing any of those guys didn't count. Yeah. So I'm going to, real quick, um, thanks for watching this part. I'm gonna, uh, we're just gonna keep playing right through, but because we are recording, it's easy to just do it in smaller bits. So I'm gonna say, yeah, have a great day.